Hello. I think we kind of made it. Hopefully we made it. Um, I just want to like kick off this event. As you know, it's been a real rough ride getting here, but we're here. I'm so glad that you all have made it. Um, this is an event that has been messed up by like snowstorms. Texas had a snowstorm. It delayed us by a week. This was the look outside my door Monday morning last week when this event was supposed to happen. There was no power. There was no heat. It was intense. So I delayed it for this week. Turns out this week was also going to be a challenge. We have had a little bit of a mess up with the online platform. Uh, yeah, now we're all over on Zoom. I want to say thanks so much for being here with us for the ZK sessions. This is the first one of its kind. Uh, so I hope from here on out it's smooth sailing, but we'll do our best. <laughs> Hopefully it's smooth sailing. Hmm. Anyway, this is the ZK sessions is a monthly event. It's kind of taking over from what was previously a biannual or semi-annual event, the ZK Summit. I was doing it twice a year in person, then we moved it online. But I think I found doing those really long online events just kind of intense. They didn't quite have the effect that I wanted. And so for this year, we're gonna be doing a, a series of smaller online events. They're gonna be monthly and they're, they're called the ZK Session. And this is the first one. So this one is focusing in on DeFi and privacy. If it's possible to combine privacy and DeFi, if it's desirable, and also what are the challenges of bringing privacy into the DeFi context? We have some fantastic speakers to help us navigate this. We have Emre from Mina, we have Guillermo from Stanford, Zach from Aztec, Tarun from Gauntlet, and Stani from Ave. We also have two fantastic sponsors. We have, I just was like, go for it. <laughs> um, Yes, so we have these amazing sponsors who I wanna just say a quick, few quick, quick words about. Uh, we have the ICF who are a Swiss nonprofit focused on supporting the development of IBC, Cosmos SDK and the Cosmos ecosystem generally. We also have Aave, which is an open source decentralized non-custodial liquidity provider on, on Ethereum. And with Aave, users can participate as depositors, meaning they can like Earn liquid. They can earn. Uh, they can provide liquidity to earn uh, passive income, and they also are kind of known for the flash loans that we've actually talked about quite a bit on the show. They're also a sponsor of the podcast, so I want to say thanks to those two sponsors for joining us for the inaugural zk sessions. I did say it was going to be a rough one. Didn't realize it was going to be this rough, but I really appreciate that you came along with us. Okay, so this event was supposed to be on Hopin and Gather Town at the end. Instead, we're now on Zoom. If you have any friends who are lost, please just help them get here and send my apologies again that we couldn't get that platform to work. Okay, there's a few things that I wanted to kind of use this time to do, and that's just talk about some of the other projects in the ZK ecosystem. Um, that is like ways to interact with the ZK community if you haven't, if you are sort of new to us or you only know us through one of these channels. So there is something called ZK Mesh. This is a newsletter. Um, I do actually have a list of links and John, I don't know if you can add them in the chat here, or if there even is a chat here, but we're going to add it. Maybe we'll add it back on Hopin if anyone wants to find these links as well. Okay. So there's ZK Mesh, which is a newsletter. Uh, there we just kind of share the latest research around the zero knowledge community, privacy tech and blockchain. Um, there's the ZK podcast telegram group. I hope you're all in there. That's where a lot of conversations happen. Oh my God. <laughs> Can you hear that? Yeah. I'm just waiting for like more <laughs> things to happen. This is amazing. Okay. It's, it's Monday. Um, <laughs> there is, this is so good. There's the ZK podcast on YouTube. Uh, we have lots of like really cool content there. If you want to check it out, ZK podcast on Reddit, really not enough people there. So if you want to join, what do you call it with a subreddit? Subscribe, join it, follow it, something. Anyway, there's, we're on Twitter. We're on Medium. We started actually a blog uh, where we talk about the, all of these concepts in greater detail. And then there's the podcast, which you might actually know us from mainly. So the podcast, I hope you're a subscriber. I hope you check it out. 
There's ways to support the podcast if you want to, or actually all of this, there's donations. We do Gitcoin grants every time that they run one of these CLR matching. You can tweet about us, you can share this or other events. You can introduce me to your smartest friends, i.e. send me proposals for people you wanna see on here. Uh, there's also, if you are a company who'd like to potentially sponsor, you can sponsor the podcast, you can sponsor events that I promise usually run a lot smoother than this one. Um, yeah, so those are the ways to do it. And one other thing that's kind of an aside, there's something called the ZK Validator. It's a separate business from the ZK podcast and all of this, but it is also a way to support zero knowledge research specifically on uh, new emerging L1s and potentially L2s because we act as a validator on those networks. And with those funds, we kind of start to support ZK research, ZK implementation on those networks. Here's where we're already live. Uh, we're soon gonna be on MENA as well. And so this is something to keep an eye on. DK validator, if you didn't know what it was. Okay, and one last thing, because this is the intro, next ZK sessions, I actually have a plan. We're gonna be doing mapping of the L2 landscape. So this might be interesting for people who are interested in ZK rollup and all of this. Also, if you are one of those projects, get in touch with me because we're still doing the programming. Okay, that's it. Thank you for listening to my intro. Apologies again for the kerfuffle in getting here. Um, I wanna sort of throw it over to Stani so that you can say a few words.